I'm making this short video to show you how to stop rugs from slipping on the floor. So I'm gonna give you a quick overview of what I'm doing here. I've got a new rug and I'm putting it on a wooden floor. This same rule will apply to rugs on carpets, rugs on floors, rugs on tiles. So I've got a little, uh, not a hack, but a little tip for you. So this is my new carpet and the carpet itself is a, a rug that will fit on the center part of my room. So I've got an extra add-on, which isn't that expensive. I actually looked around online and saw on eBay and on Amazon. You can get them. This is a wool uh, woven rug, but the magic is beneath this carpet. What I will show you is, it's actually very handy and it helps your carpet to stay in place and not slip around. So if you're in a, a location, you want like a runner carpet on the floor, this would be great. So you can see here, this is what I'm talking about. It's like a little mesh. It's not too expensive, it's not too hard to handle. It's a mesh that is sticky rubber type material. You put it on the floor and you basically put your rug on top of it. I'm gonna give you a quick demonstration here. So you've actually got this little mesh that you lie down on the floor and it actually holds in place. It's like a rubber material. It's easy to move, so you can still crease it up. Just be careful with it. But I'll show you how I put the carpet on. It's easy to unfold. If you have a heavier rug or a smaller rug, it might be easier. This is quite a big rug. And you'll see I'm not covering the full entirety of the rug itself. I'm putting it in the center of the rug. You can get bigger versions of these. I'll put a link in the description so you can see the one I've bought and how it works and how much it costs. The prices can change on these. But you can see I'm just folding it out. I'm giving it a bit of a shake there to make sure that it's got a nice uh, tight fit onto the the rug beneath it and just unfold it out if it gets creased up you can see there and this helps actually hold the, the rug in place so again uh, if you have furniture it's always a good idea to put the feet of the furniture on the rug as well to act as an extra little uh, precaution but I don't think you have to do that if you've got a hallway and you want like a runner carpet you can use a longer version of this uh, rug mesh gripper it's called different names but it's basically easy to move around you can adjust it and use different types of rugs on it and it can be used again on wood floor on carpet on tiles a number of different uh, surfaces you can see here it's like fitting nicely and it's easily you don't notice it on the carpet either so the best thing is if it's underneath the carpet and you can forget about it especially if you've got a new carpet uh, it can still bow up on the edges so what you can actually do is uh, flip the carpet upside down for a day or two let it rest and then actually if it comes roll packed to you and you order it online it just lets it stretch out and kind of get back to room temperature but the gripper itself doesn't need anything it comes folded in a square so again you can see i'm just making sure the furniture is sitting on the edges and it's a great little option i'll show you the next video on this series